Hey, Max here, and today we'll be going through RSS feeds and how to pull them into Sprinkler. Now, an RSS is simply a web feed that websites produce with articles or blog posts on them. The reason that we use RSS is so that we can monitor articles of interest to ourselves. What we'll be doing with Sprinkler is showing you how to pull in these RSS feeds into a display, display them in a monitoring dashboard within workflow columns, how to assign particular articles to another user within Sprinkler, and how to repurpose this content for your own outbound strategy. So let's get into it. So start by opening a newsfeed or blog of your choice. For us, we'll be using TechCrunch. A good indication that a page has an RSS feed is the RSS icon, found here in the top right corner. By clicking on this icon, you'll end up on their RSS feeds page, from which you can choose the one that you deem appropriate. Another shortcut for this is to go back to the home page. Click on the URL and type forward slash feed on the back. Hit enter. Most of the time, this will take you to the RSS feeds page, from which you can copy their URL. It's important to note, this doesn't work for every website. Now, let's go into Sprinkler. Within monitoring dashboards, create a new dashboard called RSS feeds. Click add column and select the RSS feeds icon. Give the column a name. We'll name it TechCrunch. You can give it a description and here paste the RSS URL. Now select add. Now you can keep repeating this process for all your regularly consumed content onto the one dashboard to look something like this. Now, if you find a piece of content that you think another Sprinkler user would be interested in, you can assign it to that user. For example, we're scrolling through and we think content approval would like this article. Select the piece of content, click the assign icon up in the top corner and select content approval. Click assign. We are also able to repost content straight from the feed for outbound content purposes. For example, hover over the ellipsis and click post this. Select the relevant account write your copy and select post. I hope you found that really really useful. If you did, please like and subscribe. We put out new videos every week and we'll see you next week. Bye!